Hi, I'm Matt Morrison, head golf professional at the Duran Golf Club. Today we're going to give you a few tips that's going to help you with your short game. We're talking about just a standard chip shot that you normally play with an 8 or a 9 iron. We give a lot of golf lessons here at Duran, and a lot of the problems that we see with the chipping motion can be fixed before you even swing the golf club. I'm going to show you a couple of setup tips that will be sure to help your chipping stroke. First, the width of the stance. We get a lot of students that have a nice wide stance when they chip almost like they're going to hit a full shot. Well, the problem is that evens the weight out 50-50 and it's real easy to hang back on your back foot when you do that and cause more of a scooping motion where you hit the ground first sometimes. We're going to eliminate that. So I want you to go ahead and narrow that stance right up. I like to teach about two club heads in between your feet. Okay, get two club heads right there and then lean that body weight right on that front foot and try to keep it there for the entire motion. Never fall back onto your back foot when you're chipping. Okay, and then remember this. Ball back, hands forward. Okay, let's get that ball back just inside this back foot and get those hands pressed forward up by your left knee. So there's some angle between your hands and the club head here. Okay, this is gonna ensure a nice downward strike into that ball, okay, and not a scooping motion. So we can be sure to hit that ball first get a nice solid shot that's going to have a nice chip and run action for us. Okay, another thing to remember, coming through impact, you want to keep those hands moving forward of the club head. Never allow the club head to flip and pass the hands. You're going to add a lot of loft and a lot of inconsistency can develop with that move right there. Here's a great drill for you. I'm just going to use another club, put it like this, so the shaft's coming up the end of the club right here. And I can make chipping motions and this shaft right here should never hit my side. If I flip my hands and the club head passes my hands, I hit my side right there and that'll tell me that I did it incorrectly. That's a great training aid. So remember, narrow stance, ball back, hands forward. Okay, and keep those hands moving forward right through the shot. You'll get a great little chipping motion. For more help on your golf swing, come see a PGA professional at the Duran Golf Club.